Hey, good morning, everybody. Sarasota Tim coming to you from inside the beautiful Cosmopolitan 52nd floor uh, suite that we got here, Tim and I. We've been up having coffee. It's, uh, what time is it, Tim? Uh, 8 o'clock. 8 o'clock. Time to go, time to leave. And that's what we're doing. The, uh, the horse has got its head turned towards the stable. Uh, we've had a couple cups of coffee each, nothing to eat. There's beautiful Las Vegas. Another chilly, gorgeous day in store uh, before the, uh, the sun lands on the earth, I understand. But uh, I mean, going back to Laughlin uh, this morning in about the next hour, uh, we're going to walk out of here together, hit the parking lot, a garage, and uh, get in our cars. He's got about a two and a half hour drive. I'm only about an hour and a half back to Laughlin. And um, I'll get the camper going and set up. I'll go ahead and make my payment and uh, pay for another week. I'll hit the pool side over there at Riverside. Tim will be back in a few days uh, from California. We'll hang out some more. i uh, go to Oreos for uh, Mexican food and uh, we'll tool around the Bullhead City. I'll get the gym doing my thing. And then my intentions are, just so you guys know, all these videos I've been talking about worrying about the air conditioning and uh, all that. I have read your comments and I know that some of you say that those air conditioner things don't work that good. Some of you say they do. Some of you are asking, well, why are you worried about that? I thought you were going up north, and I am. I am in love with this area, and I like the friends that I've made here. But there is no reason that a man that has a house with wheels on it needs to stay in one place that's, you know, not as comfortable as other parts in the country that can be. So I'm going to just, and I want to see other places. That's the whole idea. And I want to be able to bring some entertainment to you guys. So if you're interested in doing something like this one day, that you'll see these other places. I'll go out and do the legwork for you. So I'm taking the suggestions in now. I've got John, my co-pilot. He's going to be busy, I know, uh, throwing some stuff at me this week. I have to make a decision on where I'll go next. And so it could be Utah. It could be Colorado. I've got people talking about, the sun's coming in. Sorry about that. Uh, New Mexico. Uh, I, I just don't even know because I don't know what's there. All I do know is I want altitude. I want cool evenings. I don't care really if it gets like 80 or even 90 in the day because it's summer. It's going to be hot everywhere, even if you go higher altitude. But I just like it when it cools down at night. Like right now out there, it's just amazing. You know, I'm here in Las Vegas and it's like 58 or 60 degrees. Um, John is on his way to the Hyundai dealer. His rear view mirror broke off and um, he's getting that fixed. And I told him, I said, it's got a screw broken. I don't know if they're going to have it in stock. They may uh, have to order that for you. But he was wanting to, he was wanting to get together and go back over to the, uh, wherever that place where we had the breakfast buffet. And uh, I said, well, you know how it is. Once you turn the horse's head towards the barn, you know, they just want to get on home. So Tim's going to go his way. I said, I'll, get, I'll catch you on the next one. Uh, he might come over to Laughlin, or we might see him before I leave uh, in the next week. But uh, John, I, I just got to tell you, folks, I've been so blessed. John, Justin, and Tim, and Dean, and others that I've met uh, through YouTube, and the subscribers last night, uh, Rachel, Lorraine, uh, Jeff, and others that I've, uh, I'm, I'm sorry if I'm forgetting to, to mention you, but <clears throat> you're the most fantastic people and you're always so nice. It's just amazing how, you know, there's 7 billion people on the planet. We've got 350 million in this country. And most people are very, very, very sweet people. And to be able to make their acquaintance and to come into my life and to make these new buddies that I've got, I'm very, very blessed and very grateful uh, for you two providing that to me. I mean, these guys, you know, will do anything for me. I'll do anything for them. It's like we've been knowing each other for years. And some of you wrote that in the comments. And... I'm telling you, this guy, John, he's a real sweetheart. Tim, he's awesome. And uh, Dean, and like I said, everybody. And last night, uh, meeting uh, Lorraine and Rachel, best of luck to you guys. Uh, the young ladies that we met last night, late too, uh, the names escape me, but uh, you guys are from Vancouver. And uh, they, they were on a tour. They just came from Grand Canyon. They were at uh, Mount Z uh, Zion National Park uh, in Utah. Then they arrived here. And they're from Vancouver, is four very attractive young ladies. They're out just having a good time. A couple of them are friends from college. And uh, they were looking good, and they were having fun. And they were chatting up Tim and I last night. 
while we were just standing around watching the roulette table and they were inquiring about how it goes and what's going on. And we just enjoyed talking to them. And we met some other people too. Uh, it was fun just sitting there, people watching in the casino. The, uh, the gambling is not really for me. Uh, I did uh, do a little bit for entertainment on the video I showed you guys over at the buffet, but pretty much I'm not, you know, it's just not my thing. I don't understand it. it uh, it's, I don't like my money just to go away. It's all luck. But as you can see, millions love it. They come here and um, some get lucky and some don't. But I don't think anybody leaves here without a memory or an experience. Um, as far as, you know, Sin City and all that kind of stuff, you don't see that in, the, in these big fancy hotels and casinos. This is not like downtown and there can be some very sketchy areas. We went down there and uh, it was something to see. I videoed a little bit of it. It's like any town, any city. They got good and bad, uh, but it's a beautiful landscape. It's fantastic. These people here are, um, a lot of them from California, a lot of transplants that are working in the casino industry. And it's, it's quite amazing to me, the architecture of how they build these hotels and these buildings. Why don't they make everything in every city look like Las Vegas? I mean, all you have to do is build them like this. And I, that's what attracts people in. It's just, they're just amazing to look at from the outside. And, um, you know, Justin, by the way, I forgot if I mentioned his name or not. Justin, amazing individual. I'm talking about a guy that's got generosity and a heart of gold. And, uh, you know, putting us up in this $400 a night room uh, I could stay again tonight. The room is good through tomorrow. Uh, but since Tim's going to leave, you know, I've had my fill. I'm going to get on back to the uh, camper and my rent's going to be due down there uh, for another week. So I'm going to get down, make sure my batteries are still up. The refrigerator's still cold. I got those meats in there. We'll, co we'll cook something out. We'll make some ribs. We'll make some steaks. And uh, we're going to have a good time. There's so much ahead of us, folks, on this channel. And I know that it's exciting to see new things. And, you know, some of the things can become maybe mundane or, hey, another video of this or that. I will, I've been reading your comments. I'll keep it mixed up. And there's going to be that. I mean, you know, I have a life that is a, a routine daily, but it is a, also a life that's eclectic. And it's doors are being opened every day. Invitations are being made all the time. My travels are going to want to go all over uh, because I'm searching for weather. I'm searching for things to video. I want to experience for my own life. It's not really about YouTube so much as this has been a lifelong goal of mine to just, you know, get out and see this country. And I don't even have a passport. I, I don't have any interest really. I've talked a few times about moving to the Philippines or Thailand. And I mean, you know, you never know, but there's such a beautiful country that we have here and so many great places and summer's just getting started. And so if I can make my way up to the top and work my way over and do whatever, I have no idea what God will provide, but I know he will. And it's going to be the best. And if I keep meeting wonderful people like the people I just mentioned in this video, I mean, I have, I'm, I'm a blessed man. I have got it made. And uh, I feel, I don't feel alone out here. I have the community and I have made some very good friends and so I just want to say thank you again to Justin for this fantastic room, for Tim for accepting the invitation and coming and keeping me company here and hanging out, and for John who showed up and found us in the casino with one arm, struggling, get through all that traffic and parking and doing everything. He's even called me this morning and we're ready to meet up and have breakfast again or hang out today. What an individual. I mean, he's just fantastic. And then, um, like I say, Justin... Everybody. And then the girls last night that we met, I'm just repeating myself now, but I just can't tell you. I'm so filled with gratitude and happiness. And uh, working on the road today, I'll get you some videos of traveling back over to Laughlin. And um, we'll get the, uh, the crasher opened up and get it going. Meanwhile, take a look at this million dollar view here. Las Vegas. Vegas, baby. Vegas crushing it.